How to create NFT Twitter profile. Hi there, you guys. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can make your own NFT Twitter profile. Well, aside from Discord, people, um, NFT enthusiasts also use Twitter to talk about what's going on in the NFT world. So as you can see here, I've, I've, I've uh, typed in NFT users here on the search bar. And as you can see, there are lots of conversations going on. When it comes to NFTs, you guys, we can also see some profile here of some NFT enthusiasts. Let's just go ahead and check them out. Like for this one, Slack Jones. So let me just go ahead and click his account. Now, this is how his account looks like. Really simple. And he's already got like 402 followers. Uh, no cover photo, as you can see here. So let's observe, you guys, how these profiles are different when it comes to your personal profile as you can see all the stuff that they put in here are something to do with what they do like for example if they are an nft enthusiast all they put in here are like nft stuff things like that investment stuff they really don't tweet or make uh and they really don't tweet or try to create contents that are not related to nfts i think that way your profile won't be like you know because everything online works on algorithm you're building your profile based on this algorithm and once you start building your profile on that algorithm your your profile will have like more chances of being shown to other users as well so basically this is what nft profiles NFT Twitter profiles look like they try to make it more like a page at on OpenSea or more like a page on Rarible they really just go ahead and put in NFT things post NFT stuff and then that's it so what do their profiles have and that is useful for us to like copy or something and as you can see here all of these are is an um peyote fan this is, I think, a, yeah, it's on uh, OpenSea as well. So as you can see here, all of them are NFTs. But uh, this one is really cool, you guys, because it's focused. I think, wow, wow, it's really cool. And this guy, I think he likes to deal with, or he likes to make like elephant NFTs. So that's why that explains the name and the picture. Now let's go ahead and check out our profile over here oh that's the home button let's just go in okay so now my profile is called liam ft because uh, you know nft stuff and uh, liam ft as you can see you guys i really don't have anything on my profile it's it's a clean slate so let me just go ahead and upload my uh yeah upload my profile picture right here let's set up a profile I think I'll just go ahead and put in the NFT I just created, which is like Santa, Santa NFT over here. I mean, Santa's looking good, right? Okay. Now I want my NFT to have the like a Santa vibe, Santa Christmas vibe, because like it's San, it's um. Let's just skip for now. Uh, my bio would be uh, Santa things nfts for christmas santa santa holic is that even a thing okay so now we're done setting up our our profile our like um bio but i want to change my username right here cuz uh yeah i'm going to change it to Santa FT, Santa Nifty, something like that. Yes, yeah, Santa Nifty. It sounds pretty lit. Okay, so now what's missing here is like our cover photo. Well, the cover photo is really useful for some users because this is the way for them to like introduce their page a lot more better or a lot more effective. So what they do is like put on a banner right here and then. If there is like an ongoing sale of NFTs, they put it there. Or if there's like something interesting in that person's page, they put it there. Or in that creator's page, they put it there. So you can do that by using Canva. Well, Canva is a, an, an easy platform to use when it comes to like making stuff like Twitter covers or Twitter headers or posters and stuff like that. So 
I think this is the good best platform for us to use and edit something for our cover. So now let's go ahead and search in Twitter header. There you go. So now once we click that, we'll be able to see a lot of options right here, but we're looking to make something from scratch. So let me just go ahead and click this add button right here. Okay. So now we are already here. So what are we going to do next now? Let's try and add in a photo that we just, uh, um, yeah, let's go ahead and check the uploads page and we can upload a media from the downloads right here. This is Santa. And let me just go ahead and drag him onto the middle. So it will be all about Santa, you guys. There you go. So let's check out some elements that we can put in. So let me just type in Santa. And I assure you there's lots of like things that we can put here. Okay, maybe we can put in this one right here. The, the reindeers, right? Yeah, I think it's a cool match. It's like um, a crown or something. But let me just go ahead and make it more smaller. There you go. And then I hope I can make it like curve on the other side, on the on both sides, but apparently I cannot. So let me just go ahead and try to put that here. There you go. And one more thing is you can let, add texts here. So you can let other people know what you're up to. It would be like add in sale and then huge discounts, something like that. And yeah text oh sorry you have to click it first then let me just copy and paste it now let's try to make it like i think this one's looking pretty neat you guys i think so now this is what we're going to put in in our header so now let's just go ahead and try to download this one okay let's download and we're done. Now, what we have to do next is to just edit a profile once more and add in a cover photo right here. And then look for the th thing that we just downloaded. And click on apply over here. Let's go ahead and save it. That's it, you guys. Now you have your own NFT Twitter profile right here. So remember what I said? Just go ahead and build your profile all for nft you guys because your profile doesn't stop here it really goes all the way down here so when you want to engage yourself in topics such as nft go ahead and browse stuff about nft share stuff about nft and then algorithm will do the rest so that's it for this video you guys tell me what you think down in the comments below and i will see you again in the next video bye and peace out